Alright, yo people, we're just waiting for the truck to arrive, get the truck stuff done, and yeah, okay, I'll see you later during the move. Yeah, okay, bye. Alright, everyone, so the truck's finally here, so yeah, time, yeah, that's the truck, we're gonna get everything loaded, and we're gonna move, let's get to it. Alright, so, um, I guess this is not really midway, but like... We're at bank. Can you see that? I don't know if you can see that. Yeah, we're at that bank. Anyway, um, quick message. Uh, just a quick stop. Anyway, I'm gonna I'm gonna stop talking. Anyway, continue on. Let's get on with the video. All right, people. So we're well, finally here. Everything's moved in. Everything's ready. We're just gonna get actual stuff ready. I don't think you guys can see anything because it's way too dark. Anyway, uh, I'm going to leave now. Get some sleep. Frankly, this is the beginning of the video, so this video is not over. So, keep watching, and I'll see you later. Hey, hi, hello, I'm my name is Pico. Welcome back to another video. How's everyone doing today? Good? Good. Well, I hope you're doing good because if you're not doing good, then I'm not doing good. I'm not doing good either way. Anyway, if you haven't realized or noticed, I'm sick. Yeah. I don't feel so good. I'm not in the mood for too much bull right now, so I'm just gonna get to it. First of all, if you... I wanna apologize for my commentating skills, because I'm not gonna be a good commentator in this. But, yeah. So today I'm gonna be talking about how the entire movement, how when I moved, how it went. So let's get on to that. So... As you can probably tell, I got my sickness got worse. I got even more sick during the move. So yeah. Uh, after starting this video, you guys saw the little preview of um, waiting for the truck, the truck coming, and then us finally getting to our house. And then I thought I was gonna create this video, so here I am. So let's get on with the video now. First, the first trip, like I think it was like the 24th of September, right? No, not 24th. Um, 20. 27th, yeah, on the 27th of September, we basically had the truck was supposed to come at 3 o'clock, right? But it didn't show up. My dad called him. We reset till 9 o'clock, 9 o'clock a.m. for them to come and pick up our stuff. We called them again. No, this is 9 p.m. So they didn't come at 9 at all either. My dad called them. They said they were very too busy, so they couldn't come. They're like, okay, we'll come back tomorrow. Tomorrow, 10 o'clock a.m. They come. To get our stuff, turns out the truck size way too small at home. And basically meaning you have to do two trips. One trip going to now getting to our new location is basically two hours, depending on the traffic. If it's the traffic's good, it's roughly about two hours, and the traffic's bad, it's roughly about five hours. And it it turned about so basically what ended up happening was one trip going and then they, them coming back and then taking the rest of our stuff. Now, I know what you're thinking, well, why didn't it get a bigger truck? Well, I was thinking the same thing. What ended up happening was, when they asked for a bigger truck, apparently wherever they get their trucks from said that they didn't have any bigger truck, so they had to use this, which I completely think is bull, because even if that company didn't have it, you could rent it from somewhere else, too. By the way, this was not an official company who moved our truck. They weren't official, they're just some people on Kijiji. Don't ever ask people on Kijiji ever again, please, for the love of life, do not. Anyway, so, um, first trip happens, we go, they come at roughly about 10 p.m., roughly about 10 o'clock, we get there by like 6, and they get there. My dad, no, we're waiting two hours to have passed, and they still haven't come, so when my dad calls him, where are you, where's our stuff? Turns out they were either... They were, apparently they were, there was an accident on the highway, so they got delayed, but I have a feeling that's wrong, that's an excuse, because when they came, like, when the person came to pick up our stuff, he was wearing a black shirt, normal pants, and, like, short sleeve and stuff like that, when he finally came to drop off our stuff, he was wearing a white sweater, his, uh, he changed his shoes to some, uh, Jordan Airs, he was wearing Jordan Airs, stuff like that, so I have a feeling he went to his home, got stuff, got eight, and then came. 
So whatever he told us was wrong. At least that's my opinion. Anyway, so he comes at 10. We get our stuff off. Then with that, what ends up happening is tomorrow. We have to wait till tomorrow for them to go back to our house and come back. They come perfectly fine. My dad pays them, they leave. When we're checking over our stuff, it turns out that two of the things were broken during the move. Something happened to them, something bad, and my dad could, what happened is happened, but I couldn't do anything about it. And yeah. So that's basically the trip. And now I'm back home, getting everything ready so far. We got a few of things ready. My stuff is ready. Computer, I still don't have any internet connection, so I mean. When this video uploads, then I'll have internet connection because I'll be doing the internet stuff. But right now, I don't have any network connection. Um, so, yeah. So, yeah. And then, now, I wouldn't call it my worst trip experience because me talking about it doesn't really show you um, the worst experience it is. Day one, when there was basically, I'll explain in a short summary. Day one, when they were supposed to come, they didn't come because apparently they were busy. First, they brought the wrong truck. The trip could have taken one truck, one big truck, would have went, and that was it. But we had to make it two trips. Both of them, roughly combined to have what about six hours at least, going and coming, getting our stuff. Next up, on the first day where we could have made two trips and went and left and would have gotten all our stuff on that day. Turns out either the guy went to his home, did eat, ate something or went on a field trip, whatever he wanted. Something else happened. He ended up coming at 9 o'clock p.m. And going back and forth was pretty useless. It was, they'd probably come tomorrow. So tomorrow happened. They come, they get our stuff, a couple of things are broken. Alright, fine. We move in. And here we are. Now I know what you're thinking, that doesn't seem like a bad thing. Well, first of all, let's go back to the truck. You remember how I said that they brought a small truck? Well, what they, what the person did, who the moving person, they actually came to our house first to look at all our stuff, measured everything, and said, okay, this is the truck we're gonna need, and left. They got the, either they got the wrong, and what, and then they brought a smaller truck. My dad asked, again, my dad asked them what happened. They basically said, you didn't have that truck, you couldn't rent that truck. Well, you can rent for the company. Yeah. Yeah, okay, so that's basically it. <sighs> now, uh, for those of you who are wondering, for school, school hasn't really started yet. For my brother and sister, they start tomorrow. For us, we haven't got any sort of message or anything like that. So we, I have no idea school's gonna start for us or when it's gonna start, so... We're gonna blank slate here. Anyway, that's all I really gotta do. I still have a couple more things to do. I'll, um, before I leave, I just want to say, please comment down below for Shadow of Sunday. Um, Shadow of Sunday's video is going to be, I know it didn't come out on Sunday, but it's going to be coming out after this video. I'm too busy, I'm sorry. But yeah, again, thank you. You guys are awesome. You should feel awesome. You girls are awesome. You should feel awesome. Don't forget to subscribe because it really helps me out. And yeah, the best of the rest of your day. Bye for now.